Hey everybody, this is Andrea from My Chihuahua Bites. Um, I thought that I would give you a tutorial today on how I put on my liquid foundation. Um, you know, everybody has their own methods, but I just thought I'd show you how I do mine. Um, I am using MAC Studio Sculpt. It has SPF 15. Um, I bought this a couple of weeks ago. I've been using it for a couple of weeks. Um, I like it so far. It's a heavier foundation, so it provides um, more coverage if you need that. Um, I already have on my concealer underneath my eyes and around my nose. Um, so, here goes. Um, I put a little bit on my hand. This is actually a lot of foundation, but I'd rather use too much than too little. Um, this is the brush I use. It is a Bare Essentials brush. It's a skunk brush. I just really like the application that this gives. Um, MAC also makes um, a similar brush. It's the... 187. I use this for a different purpose, but um, this is a really good brush as well. So I am going to dab my brush into my foundation, kind of spread it out over my hand to get the excess off. And then I just start rubbing over my face just like this. Don't focus on getting it um, perfectly blended or um, perfectly applied at this point, you're still going to go back over it, so it's okay if it isn't perfect. Um, I just think that this provides um, kind of a light hand with your foundation, kind of an airbrushed look um, that I like. Um, and um, I'm not a big fan of putting foundation on my fingers. I know a lot of people are, and, and that's fine if that's what you do, but um, I just, for some reason, I, I just don't like it. I used to put foundation on with a um, sponge, but when you apply it with sponges, the sponge kind of um, soaks up a lot, and so you waste a lot of foundation. So, go back over my dark spots one more time. So, as you can see, I just kind of put it on all over. Um, just to note, if you use your makeup brushes to do liquid foundation, you should wash them every single time. Um, I'm not saying I do, but you're supposed to. Um, I try to do it every night. Alright, so next step would be powder. I'm using MAC Mineralized Skin Finish and Light. Um, this is a good powder. Um, I also really like MAC... Um, studio fix but that powder is meant to kind of stand on its own it's meant to be used as a foundation as well um, so that's a little heavier you really shouldn't use it on top of liquid foundation this is the brush I'm using bare essentials heavenly brush I really love this brush so I'll just go over my foundation I accidentally got this brush wet so It's a little damp as I'm putting it on. I'm not using tons and tons of powder, but this just helps your makeup to set and takes away any shine. And also, is blending it in. Last step is this is a MAC 185 brush. I love this brush. This is my favorite brush. It is expensive, it's about $35. I got it from the um, cosmetic outlet. But it's a wonderful, wonderful brush. I love it. It's the best kabuki I've ever used. So now I am just going to go over it with the kabuki just to make sure everything is blended in. Oh, I used not to have to wear so much makeup, but it seems like since I've had a baby, my skin is just... I have a lot of dark spots, um, it's, I have rosacea, so um, I'm just now starting to use a heavier foundation. Um, you guys know that I've always talked about my love of Bare Essentials. Um, I still love Bare Essentials, it's just, I think it, it takes a while to apply if you apply it well, so I save that for special occasions. Um, 
Another foundation that I love, again, is the MAC Studio Fix. This is what I use when I'm in a hurry and I just want to get my foundation on and go. I usually use this most mornings that I work. Um, this can be a light foundation or a heavier foundation, depending on how you apply it. A lot of times I will wet the sponge, put it on for a heavier application, and then buff it out with my Kabuki brush. But this goes on like in a minute flat, so I love this for mor mornings that I'm just in and out of the door. So, there you go. There's my foundation technique. Um, obviously, this use, works for liquid foundation. I apply um, powder foundation completely different, which I might do a tutorial at some point on how I put on my Bare Essentials makeup. But, um, if you have any questions, please be sure to leave them in the comments and I will try to answer them for you. Um, I apologize for the mess that is my hair. Um, but, um, thanks for watching.